Don't just worry about yourself. Hey guys, it's me again, Douglas. And today I wanted to talk to you guys about putting others first, right? You know, valuing others more than ourselves, which can be really, really important. You know, not just because because it's better for other people, but it's better for us too. You know, life is like like a team sport. I don't know if you play any sports. I, I play soccer and I played I played a little bit of football very badly. But you know, in these games, it's very important to play as a team. If you are a ball hog and you never pass the ball to anybody else and you only care about, you know, doing everything yourself, you're always going to lose. You know, in like soccer or football, there's there's 11 other people on the other team and then there's 11 people on your team, but if you never think about your teammates, then it's just 11 people versus you. You're never going to win that way. Now, I said I played football very badly, and that's because I'm no good at football. I tried out for the team and I made the team, but I did not play one game. My little legs can't run very fast. But you see, there was one game where I almost got to play because there's this kid in my class, his name's Isaiah, and he is so fast. He is really good at stuff, like everything. He's good at everything. And uh, he he was playing football. He was on, you know, on my team, and we were playing against his other team, and Isaiah's shoe, it split in half. Like, I've never seen this happen before. It was like, it just split right in half. It was like he had a shoe for his toes, and he had a shoe for his heel, and nothing in the middle. And my first thought was, admittedly, a selfish thought, because I thought to myself, I'm going to get to play, because Isaiah's shoe busted. And I kind of went over to the coach as, as, you know, Isaiah was coming back to the side, and I, I was, you know, kind of expecting the coach to say, okay, Douglas, you can go on in. And I looked down at Isaiah's shoe, and I realized that he wears the same size shoe as me. And I looked over at his shoe, and I looked at my shoes, and his shoe, and my shoes, and I knew what I had to do. So I took off my shoes, and I took them over to Isaiah, and I said, here, wear are these instead? So he was like, oh, great, thanks, Douglas. And he took my shoes, and he put them on, and he went back out, and he played, and we ended up winning that game with me sitting on the bench in my sock. Now, if I had been selfish and said, wow, this is my time to shine, what a lucky break that Isaiah's shoe got all busted. We would not have won that game. No way. But because I put the needs of the team and the needs of my friend Isaiah first, we got to win. And the truth is, I really didn't sacrifice very much at all. Because after the game, everybody was like, thank you, Douglas, so much for giving Isaiah your shoes. And so I kind of got to be the hero a little bit by putting others first. Now, I'm not saying that we should put others first so that we can be the hero. But I am saying that when we put others first, things will go better for us, not just other people. Life is like a team sport where everybody is on your team. So when you put the needs of others ahead of your own, not only do those other people win, but you win too. Too many people treat life like it's a like it's a game, yeah, but they treat it like like everyone else is the opponent. If you help somebody else, you're going to lose. But that's not how it works. It might seem that way sometimes, but I promise you that if you put others first, things will go better for you. And so that's my challenge to you guys today is that you would put others first. Don't just think about your own self. Think about what other people need and about how you can help them. Now, I'm not saying that you should only care about other people and never care about yourself. You know, the Bible says that you should love your neighbor as yourself. If you don't love yourself at all, if you don't care for yourself at all, then how can you care for other people? God doesn't say only care about other people. God says care about other people just as much as you care about yourself. And I promise that the more you put the needs of others first, the better your life will be. Hey guys, I hope you liked this video. And hey, today I just wanted to thank you guys so much, especially my patrons. Thank you so much for your support. Even just by watching this video, you're helping to support my ministry. So thank you so, so much. And hey, if you would like to learn more about how you can help my channel, you know, financially, then you should totally check out patreon.com slash Douglas Talks. You can support my ministry there, or you can go to douglastalks.com. There's all kinds of ways that you can help to support my ministry. You know, if it wasn't for, for you guys out there watching right now, I wouldn't be able to do what I do. It is only through the grace of God and the generosity of awesome people like you that I can make videos like this and spread the good news of Jesus Christ to kids all over the world. So I just wanted to say thank you Thank you. Thank you.